Hello there, Flamer is a silent heavy killer and Beth made it way better on BTS. The damage is the same, but they changed AP cost, so we can use it with Vaz crit build. And Beth played around with damage resistances of some enemies, so anti-armor version became more epic. And it is not all. We have a new legendary modification that we can use with flamers to make them even stronger. Ladies and gents, I present you Pyromaniacs. The description says when a combat target is burning, deal plus 50% bonus damage. And right here we are getting the king of DPS among all heavies and probably globally. Or maybe not. So Puppy's damage resistance gonna drop down to 27, 3 times lower than on PTS and or on life server, sorry. And numbers will tell you the actual difference. It's time to cook him alive. So basically the damage is two times stronger already. It should be over enough to cook everything quite fast, even if you go full healthy. And to stay completely honest with you, I need to add that there is a big gun's bubblehead being involved here. But without it, the damage is still crazy. So for power armors, anti-armor is a good option. And if you want to use it in VATS, the lowest you can go is uh, 8 action points, if I did not miss something. <laughs> but I'd rather go with huge tank. So let's try it. I go with bloody, but anti-armor would be just fine here. I think bloody is better, because the damage reduction coef should be quite low. But I did not run numbers on my calculator, so I'm just uh, guessing. And as you can see, you can be as sneaky as a foxy fox. So basically you need Vaz Creed build with your favorite perks. You can do it better than me here, I just uh, made it as quick as possible, because I'm lazy. Be heavy, be sneaky, be tenderizery. Okay. Of course follow through is still great to have as well. And 33 luck plus 1 point just in case, in case of blood disease. Obviously, don't forget about critical savvy to make every second shot critical. Vascrit build on steroids should make Flamer the best damage dealer of the game. Tell me what's stronger in the comment section to see if I'm wrong or right. Okie dokie, let's cook. So, I'm just going to try normal mobs and uh, by the way, no extra buffs uh, except for Bubblehead. <laughs> Damn, <laughs> I look if here to show its full potential against Euro or other bosses because I don't want to see Flamers be nerfed and Beth can increase AP cost. That's for sure. Should we try Krabby Mafia? I love that. Hey, <laughs> already cooked. Look at this! Puppy, puppy, pu puppy is here! Puppy is no more here. Am I in danger? Why? Now everything's fine, and now the puppy is being cooked! Yeah. Once again, I did not run numbers to compare weapons for the strongest DPS. Maybe Enclave Plasma Flamer will be still stronger. Actually, don't know. But I hope Beth will not touch Flamers no more. Please don't do it. Yay. Big thank you for watching. I'll see you later. Bye bye bye. Bye bye.